All right, well, it's another day. Um, yesterday we got called in to do some work, so I had to drive all the way back, but today we will be doing Gold Rock. I'm on the other side of the Turnigan Arm, so I live right there. This is Bird Ridge. This is Indian House. Right back there you can see uh, it's Homicide. You can't see North and South Suicide. It's a little too far. Um, focus that a little bit. But yeah, so I went from way over there and drove all the way around. This is Penguin Ridge, Penguin Peak. It goes all the way to Girdwood. And then Girdwood wraps all the way down through the Kenai and then comes through here and here we are. You can see uh, my companion here. Is he visible? There he is. Yep, he is ready to get on the trail. No BS. No BS. Let's do this. done gold rock so we'll see what it's gonna be like March 29th, almost in April. Everything's kind of starting to melt, but we still have a lot of condensed snow, packed down stuff. And luckily, people have taken this trail, so maybe they've taken it the whole way. Here comes a runner right now, so. So actually crossing the bridge and going to the left, you can either head this way up to the Hope Point Trail, and I believe this is our sign to go for uh, Gold Rock. So here we go. Been about a 
two year in the making uh, endeavor, I guess. I've done Hope Point, I think three times? Two or three times. Definitely did it with Zach and then one other time before. Um, this trail, I pass by every time. I did those and it's just a right across the turning arm when I look on my app. So it only makes sense to do it sometimes, but it's a little bit of a drive. But for being on the south side of the arm, looking at the north shore at the end, I've seen some pretty cool pictures. And I think today, being that there's still snow out and uh, if we can time it and see low tide, there should be some big ice chunks. Stuff that'll make it look pretty cool. This is all pretty awesome right now. I haven't needed my ice cleats yet. We just started out, but I might need them later on. Yukon, stop pulling me. There's a few deep uh, imprints in the boot tracks, but nothing crazy. Seems pretty well packed down. So that's a good sign. We won't be postholing all day, perhaps. So I just do this in boots. Serve some battery. We got a long, long way to go. This is going to be 11 miles total today. So five and a half out, five and a half back. So uh, yeah, here we go.
spruce grass over here. No, it's a Stellar's J. Stellar's J. Black and blue. Those are cool birds. They make cool noises. Yukon, you can't get it. snow
keep sinking. Not quite our island, and not our rock. We'll keep going. Got to this little crossing where a bunch of snow came down. Avalanche zone. And boy, did it come down. Cut across to the rest of our trail here. We're pretty close to the end. We are pretty close to the end. This last mile has been super tough. Someone has like semi blazed the trail, but uh, yeah, they, uh, awkward steps, smaller boots, so it's just kind of a pain right now. It's our goal. That little rock, not that much more to go. Well, we made it. We're now officially on Goal Rock. Whew. Oh man, I got just enough battery life. So yeah, this was a uh, Gold Rock Trail. Pretty good, did not disappoint. There were some tough sections with uh, hard packed snow, but uh, yeah, this was real good. Looks like there's a few ways to kind of go down and head out onto the beach, but I'm gonna explore this area a little bit more until the camera dies, I guess. I know it kind of opens up over here. Let's go see the, the North Shore a little bit more. in a trail. Oh, as I say, that's hard pack. Here we go. Hopefully the camera will live long enough. Soul Central now. I hear you. 
Mwah. Yukon is fascinated with ravens. Woo! <laughs> oh man, I got snow in my shoes now. This is a cool area. It's actually dry. There we go. Here's what I wanted to see. Now I can see the Lake Clark mountains back there, like uh, Mount Spur. I'm sure you'll see Leomna and all those. Leave me alone. There's a few more little camp spots. This is real cool. I'll have to camp here. Sometime. Yukon, what you doing? Come here. Come here, bud. Oh. <laughs> Let's go check out the rest. See what we can see. Yeah, Gold Rock. This was a cool one. The last, I guess it was a mile, mile and a half was post holy um, there were some tracks for the majority of that little last section but they were terrible to try to follow in oh dry ground That's a cool sight to the front over there. I don't know, we'll keep following it. It might ring around to the left. Oh, this is definitely getting slick. You can't stop pulling me. Too cool. It's a big wall of ice. That's what that is. All right, well, it's probably super bright behind me. This was a uh, Gold Rock Trail. We're on Gold Rock at the moment. We got the ice behind me, tourniquet arm, a bunch of mountains I can list off for you. All we 
you, Conrad, here. This was a good day, good hike. I got this raven. Won't leave me alone. Zoo! Interesting. Cool. All that ice. Guess we'll film a little bit of this rocky climb. This way. Dude is like on a mission. I think this is about the coolest spot. Yeah, I think we'll take a break up here. Drink a little water, have a little cliff bar or something. <laughs> 